background. Well, one veteran is making today about serving the people who need it most. He knows the tragedies of war can translate into civilian life. CBS 4's Maggie Lunlin reports he's trying to use that knowledge to help others. Thank you so much, Zana, for all the hard work you've done for Thank the country. You. In honor of Veterans Day, Cedric Halyard gives back to so many who've served. These bags of supplies are a thank you gift from school children. Thank you so much for all the hard work you've done. But Halyard doesn't just honor veterans on holidays. For him, helping homeless and low-income veterans is his life's work, his passion. Me, myself, I am a formerly homeless veteran. And once I got out of the military in 1992, I found myself wandering the streets of Miami, not knowing where the next meal would come from, not knowing who to turn to. He says he turned to drugs, but after losing everything he owned, he finally turned to a VA hospital. God bless America and God bless the Veterans Administration, the VA hospital. The nurse that I encountered in that VA, she said, son, you need help. Years later, thanks to the help of several veterans assistance organizations, he is a nurse, a homeowner, and the veterans outreach director at Operation Sacred Trust. He helps veterans find employment and housing, and he lets them know there's hope. I share my story. I says, look, I was you. I sat on that same side of the table or the chair. I was full of pride and anger, but by the help of the VA and supportive services, that changed. All you have to do is be willing and open to just take a chance. And on Veterans Day and every day, their hope for the future is all the thanks he needs. You're good people. Love you, man. Love you, too. And Halyard says the biggest problems veterans face are finding jobs, finding affordable housing, and overcoming their own pride to ask for help. Shannon Elliott. So he's really asking businesses out there, look to veterans for, for possible employment. That's right. He says veterans are very dedicated to their work. They're very dedicated to their jobs when they come back. So if you can help out, he's asking people to employ veterans if they can. And on top of everything else, they get a tax break. So yeah. another good reason to do it. Absolutely. Thanks, Maggie. Thanks, Maggie.